Hey guys, so today we are making some potato cakes for Makudas. Please make this for someone you love. Make sure you share, subscribe, and like this video if you want more. So here I'm just chopping up my potatoes in smaller pieces so that they cook faster. And I'm going to boil them up till they're like done, but not quite so done, like potato salad done. Um, you don't want them to turn into mashed potatoes for texture purposes. That's just my preference and all the measurements in the description box below um, so over here I'm just really making sure that I get any of those chunks out again not smoothing them out completely just sort of um, easier so that when you go to make your patty they're a lot easier to sort of scoop um, now I'm just adding parsley and I'm really supposed to be adding cilantro but I added parsley which is also very good um, in there um, it adds a different flavor now I'm gonna add in one egg and um, that's just gonna keep help keep the patty together. Now I'm gonna add in some salt and, and some black pepper. In goes the onions and we're just gonna mix that until it is nice and combined. Now we're going to go ahead and add some cumin powder. Um, it brings out a great flavor. Now we're going to add in some minced garlic. Um, I was kind of sort of heavy handed with that. Then I added some Creole seasoning. I love this stuff. Here comes some chili powder. Now go ahead and mix all those flavors together. Now we're going to want to refrigerate this for 30 minutes to an hour and when it's ready you are going to be scooping out small balls and just uh, roll them in your hand a little bit and then drop them in some flour and roll them a little bit, shake off the excess and flatten them out with your hand um, to mimic a patty. Um, you should however use some of that water to help with your hands and it's going to help with that sticking so you don't have to worry about it again. I we'll have about two to three tablespoons of oil um, on the pot and once it's ready you want to drop in your patties and fry them till they are a beautiful golden brown color. Now guys you can even add chicken, cheese or tuna to these. Um, they are delicious and I would like to thank you all for watching. Later!